Well, this is just too good of a deal to not start the video showing this off. The Starbucks Christmas tumbler is $14.99. It was $50 when it was in the parks, and oh my god, you guys, check this out. I'm just gonna step back, and you can see they have got a whole bunch of them here. And now I counted the boxes. There are over 300 tumblers at the time of filming, so they've got them out. They want us to buy them, but let's go ahead and check out the rest of the store because I bet we're gonna discover some awesome deals here at the Disney Character Warehouse. There is still tons of Christmas stuff here at the Character Warehouse, and if you want a full comprehensive look at the whole store, I recommend checking out our three-part series that we did about two weeks ago. We showed off every single piece of merchandise, and so what we're going to focus on this go-around is some of the newer items, things that we didn't see before, some of those hot ticket items that are reasonably priced or very well discounted. So we have the Mickey's and Friends Christmas mug going for $5.99. It was a $20 mug. It's a great little mug, a nice little candy cane handle on there with Pluto on one side with Chippendale building a snowman and Mickey and Minnie enjoying some cocoa on the back side. Those, like I said, $5.99 or $20. Holiday headbands are $15 there for the one person that keeps pointing out that I don't want to say the $99. i am going to do my best, but it's a hard habit to break. $15 was $35. These holiday tins are a dollar. Now, there were two styles at one point. There's the Wally and Eve style, and then there was a Mike and Sully, but I only see the Wally and Eve. But still, a nice little tin for a buck. You can't beat it. It's a great little holiday cookie tin. $15 for the onesie. I love the little Star Wars logos and symbols and design on this. It's just so cool with all the little snow globes. And these are $15. Like I said, they were $35 the last time they were in the parks. Such a cool little onesie. They only have those in extra smalls though. Droid Advent Calendar is an awesome thing to grab. If you're into advent calendars, this was $80, it's down to $30. You can buy one now, save it for next year, and you've got your advent calendar already picked out. It's got a bunch of droids in it. It's a great little way to uh, to celebrate advent. We actually got the Star Wars Lego advent calendar, and I didn't have any time to build it this year, and I'm bummed about it. But good news is I'll be able to build it this next year. They definitely have a better selection of kids' Crocs at this character warehouse versus the iDrive character warehouse. They are down to $30, and I believe Crocs are typically $65 to $70. And these are the holiday style Crocs. They got those nice little fuzzy Mickeys on them, and then a fuzzy inside to keep your feet warm. Something we didn't see last time was this awesome little sign. These are $13. They were $30, and they say Merry Wishes on them. On It looks like that one's backwards because uh, the Merry Wishes is supposed to be on this side. You see that here? Looks like that one's a little bit of a misprint. Now, I do believe they light up, but it looks like they've been taken out of their box to give you the little demo. But you can see the lights light up right there. And then they have these cookie mugs. These are $12. They were $25. So you put your cookie in that side. You put your hot cocoa in that side. Nice wide, nice wide rim. So you can do some dunking, like I said, at $12. Nice little candy cane handle. And this one's got beauty and the beast bell and the beast on there. Look at, she's holding a little uh, Santa Claus. Looks like a Santa Claus cookie, I love that. And the Beast has the snowman cookie. Now they do have another style here. This is Peter Pan with a carousel. These also, same price, they're $11.99. These are Disney's Beach Club. So these are after the resorts. And this one is Grand Floridian. So there's probably one for every resort, I would imagine, but looks like they only have those two here. Like that kid's onesie, you can get a dog outfit to go with it these are eight dollars looks like they just have them available in mediums right now those are some cute little pet apparel and they also have the you'll be merry marvel style they have those in a couple different sizes smalls extra larges those are going to be eight dollars as well now i will say this i have a nice big 70 pound dog his name is murphy the extra large does not fit him so just keep that in mind if you've got a larger dog sometimes those extra larges can be a little bit tight if they've got a thicker neck and thicker body got lots of these pin ornaments these are really cool because they come with a pin and a lanyard and a mystery item or no excuse me a pin and a mystery item and that mystery item could be a lanyard or a magnet or a patch and then it's a nice little display that you've got here and so far they've got abu when he is the elephant they've got the mouse from dumbo and let's see i think they've got nope that looks to be it right now and those are going for well it's 24 dollars at one point $8.99 or $9. There you have it. These little dome displays are going for $13 or $12.99. They do light up. There you go. And what's great about this is they've left them inside of their boxes. So if you do buy one, have to travel with it, you don't have to worry about wrapping it up. You can bring it home in a nice sturdy box and hopefully make it safe and sound to your destination. 
Now I do love that they are they keep some things in the boxes here at the character warehouse like this ornament right here is going for $8 a 2022 ornament like I said, always great to see that it's left in the box for safekeeping. And then the 2022 other style Mickey and Minnie ornament, there's that. Also $8, you can get those in the box and take those with you. Love to see that. These are some fun little box of surprises. They are $20, they were $40, so you get 12 days of jewelry. So there's 12 different gifts inside of those, like earrings or necklaces or things like that. Bubble wands are always fun. The first time I ever came to Disney, I thought that they had bubble machines. No, lo and behold, it's just kids with bubble wands spraying bubbles everywhere. And you know what? I think that's awesome too. These are $13, $12.99. We're originally $32 in the parks, but you can grab one here and travel along with it. Take it with you as you go. And it's reusable too, so you can refill it with that bubble juice and keep making bubbles all year long. We always love showing off the mugs and the different ceramic things here. These are $13. They're from the cookie stroll from the holiday cookie stroll at the International Festival of the Holidays. We love this. The idea was that you bought a cookie jar and then you went around, you did the holiday stroll, you put all your cookies in the cookie jar and you go home. They're $20. Oh, they say $20, but this sign says they're $13. Interesting. So usually that's interesting if they're 13 dollars, that's an amazing deal right now we're seeing a lot of stuff that's just 50 percent off which is really good considering you know if you followed us for quite some time you'll notice that you know in the last year or so the prices had been elevated like these mugs that were 23 dollars down to 11 were maybe 14 dollars instead same with like t-shirts if they were 37 dollars then they were only like 20 dollars now we're seeing all those discounts come back and then we this is a awesome little ceramic mug from Tiana, it's Color Me Courtney is the brand, and those are going for $13 as well, so there's a nice $10 off on those. And then the Tiana's Restaurant Fund mug, also from Color Me Courtney, those are going for $6, they were $20. That's a great mug, it's nice and large, we call those soup mugs. You can put a can of soup in there, heat it up, a nice hot soup that you can sip on. I love the Mickey's and Minnie's Runaway Rail mug. It is such a cool, fun design. I think it's an awful mug to drink out of, because it's square, but I mean, this is something you put on your desk, you put a bunch of pens and pencils in it, or you hang it on the wall in your kitchen. It's just a fun mug. It's really, it is. And it's $15, they were $23 in the park, so a whole bunch of those here. I imagine that if they stick here long enough, then we will start to see the price go down on those as well. And these mugs are just super fun. They are Mickey and Minnie style mugs. See Minnie there and Mickey there, and they've come with this nice little foam hat cover. And those go for $13, they were $25 in the park. I hope that I'm satisfying your need. The person that keeps watching it cannot remember your name. But yes, $13, not $12.99. Trying to make it easier on you and our listeners so you can get a better idea of the price. Looking at more of the mugs, they have the mugs that magic magically reveal things when you get hot liquid inside of them. It's a really cool little mug. And these go for $6. There's more of those Christmas mugs, so you can see there's a whole bunch of them. And they have a Norway mug from the Epcot World Showcase. It's got Minnie and Mickey on it as well. Very cool to see that. Those are going for $7. Then down below that, we have our uh, Good Vibes Only mug. Those are also $6. We got our Dr. Strange mug going for $6. That's what that looks like. That also reveals uh, with hot liquid, I believe. Yes, hot liquid reveals certain things inside of it. Super cool. And then the Hawkeye mug, I think is awesome because it comes with that little spoon that looks like an arrow. And those go for, we're 23. Let's see if we can find a discounted price on one of those. Those are going for $6 as well. So lots of really excellent discounts on mugs. Always a good place to buy a mug. Realize in my last tour of the Character Warehouse, I forgot to do the pins. These are $8.99. And these are so fun because his mouth moves up and down. It's so cute. These are $8.99, $9. They were $20 in the parks. Then they got the Buzz Lightyear version. And they also have a Sully version. So there's three different pins here. There may have been more in the collection, but I just know that those were here. Like I said, $9 for those were $20 in the parks. Let's go ahead and spin this around. We've got pop sockets galore. These are all different pop sockets. Actually, they're all orange bird pop sockets, $8. And then down below, we've got the Christmas pop socket. And it actually is like snow globey style. As you can see, there's little beads inside of there that shake around. And so you can swap them out. They were $27. So the fact that they're $8 is a great deal. Over here, we have the Peter Pan floating down Main Street. That is part of that collection. I think those were limited edition. They did a different character every month. They were 20 down to nine. And then these transformation story pins. These are pretty cool. Do they move? Do they open? It looks like it does something. Nope, it's just stacked. But there you have Jafar and his different transformations. 
also a $9 pin. And then the fine and dandy, this looks like a Dapper Day 2022 pin. Those were $20, also down to $9. And we've got some Christmas pins, the cheer pin here with Mickey on there going for $6 with silver, which I think is $9.99, so just a few dollars off on that. And then with this awesome holiday pin here where they're decorating a big castle. That's a massive pin, it was 35. Let's see if we can see a discounted price down to 17. On the other side here, the holiday mystery pins, a whole set, these are $7 were $18. And those are the different pins that you can get. Looks like you get two random pins per pack and uh, two, four, six, eight, maybe eight total pins in the collection as it appears to be maybe more unsure. Yeah, so it looks like the collection was eight pins. I think I saw that on there. Yep, full collection includes eight pins. See it right there on the box. A couple of Marvel pins. We've got the Hawkeye pin still. Those are $8. And then a few different Marvel. We got the Falcon and Iron Man. Those are $5. Creeping it real. This is from the Halloween collection with our villains on there. Those are going for $4. It's a, that's a really great deal. $4 for a pin. And then down below, we've got the Marvel Snow Globe pin. This is from Christmas this year. Very cool pin. This is going for $7. It was $15 in the park. So let's get another good look at that. There you go. And you can see all the snowflakes on there. Such a cool pin. On the other side, we've got the Lightyear pins. It's a $7 pin, was $18. And the Pride Collection pins. Does that spin? It looks like it does. It does. It's a nice little spinner pin. These are $7. They were originally $18. And then the keychain set. These are so cool. I love these with the alien and Doug. I just thought this was such a cool design. They were $20 down to $13. They have a variety of these Star Wars character pins. They are $7. They were $18. They're like the old style action figure limited release. Looks like there's a Han Solo one. I haven't seen him before. So we got Chewbacca, Han Solo, we've got a Tusken Raider, we've got Jawas, Luke Skywalker down here at the bottom. And then there's lots of these Stony Clover patches. They're $20, they were $31 for the larger ones, and then the smaller ones, look for $13, were $20. So a whole bunch of those, good variety of patches that you can do to customize your Stony Clover uh, backpacks and handbags and all of that good stuff. A lot of really fun accessorizing you can do with this brand. And then there's a Kenobi pin, out of random. I don't see a discounted price in them. It was $18, so let's see if these on another spinner we can get a price. Oh, this is a really cute Christmas countdown pin. It was $18 down to $7. We've got uh, Hero and Mochi and, is I mean, saying that right? I think I'm saying that right. The cat's name and Baymax, I love it. That's one of my favorite movies. I hope they come out with a sequel that I would love to see a second one. All those characters are so great. And this is really cool, this is Bambi. A Bambi poster pin is going for seven dollars. It's really cute. It was eighteen, and then we've got some other Bambi pins because I think they're coming up on a Bambi anniversary, and that's why we're seeing a lot of Bambi merchandise come up, and obviously hit the character warehouse because it's um it's not a movie that people you know really recognize or watch a whole lot anymore. There's nothing really in the parks uh, for Bambi, surprisingly enough. We got these dioramas that were seventeen. I don't see a discounted price on them. I imagine they're discounted a little bit. But uh, yeah, maybe they're maybe they're down to like six ninety nine or something like that. I don't see a price. I don't see a sign, so I can't give you a full thing on that. But they are from Pandora. Over here, we've got some patches from Monster University's the Disney Flare Customizer Style. This is really cool. These are a two dollar patches. Patches were typically ten dollars, and these are stickers. I love that. That Monsters University Go Monsters. Another two dollar sticker. And then a couple different stickers here, Rope Drop, Regular, Hidden Mickey Hunter, also $2 stickers, very cool. And then a Thor Love and Thunder sticker package. You get eight, $8, There's a bunch, it's a six pack, so $8, so yeah. Just under $2 a sticker, that's a pretty great deal. Donald Duck Thanksgiving pin, these are going for $7. And then we've got a Happy Rosh Hashanah. Am I saying that right? I don't know what, um, holiday that is. I'll have to look that up. If you do know what holiday is, let me know. Rosh Hashanah. And uh, if you celebrated it, I hope you had a wonderful day. Those are $7 pins. Awesome. And then Miss Marvel. Those are $7 pins as well. They were $18. Now here are the Kenobi pins. So we found a whole bunch of them. They're all $7. I enjoyed this series quite a bit. 
I know a lot of people had a lot of negative things to say about it. Yes, I think it got really slow in certain areas, and some of the scenes were a bit tacky, but I think overall it was an excellent series. I really enjoyed it, especially the, the ending. $4 for this R2-D2 head keychain. That's pretty cool. And on the back side here, we've got some Star Command, some metal keychains. Socks was the best part of Star Command, uh, or a uh, Lightyear movie. Like $5 for those keychains. There's a good look at that. And then we've got the Dapper Dan Pop, Funko Pop pin. Those are going for $7. Nice large pin was $16. Now there are still a lot of Crocs here, and these are going for $25 for the blue tie-dye style. It looks like they have some larger sizes here as well. The other stores seem to be kind of narrowing in on a few of the smaller sizes or mid sizes. And then they have the Vault Collection balloon Crocs with all those balloons coming out of Walt Disney World from Florida, and these are going for $30. They were $55. Looks like they got a few larger sizes, a little bit more variety in this as well. I'm not gonna go through every size because that would just take a while. And they have the Cinderella 50th Anniversary Castle Crocs, and these are going for $30. Now it looks like they got some big sizes down here, some big, big sizes, and then some smaller sizes here. So a nice little variety there, but not too many left. I know that they had a really good deal on Shop Disney for these, and I think uh, they pretty much got wiped out. So if you're looking for these, the only place you get these ads at the Character Warehouse right now. And if you are looking for these, go ahead and Click that description, find our Facebook group, and join our community so you can shop with us. Brittany is here. She is our main shopper. She's also my wife, and she is doing a live shop with our VIP members. So if you're interested in all that, there's information in the description. Be sure to check that out. Join our community. We'd love to have you. And if you're already part of our community, go ahead and give me a like and a comment down below. Say, hey, I'm here. I'm part of the community. Thank you so much. And I just want to say thank you for being part of the community. I hope you've had a good experience with us shopping. I hope you find these videos useful. That's what they were intended to be for, was specifically for our group. But obviously, there's lots of our viewers that are not part of our Facebook group. or just like watching the videos. And you know what? That is totally cool, too. So Star Wars Crocs, we got these for $30. We're $55. Lots of larger sizes here, which is good. I see some I see some that might actually fit me. I'm not really a croc person. Those are men's 11s. Those are huge. I'd never see them that size. Um, but yeah, I'm not a croc person, but I know a lot of people are die-hard croc wearers and they absolutely love them. They think they're like the best thing on the planet. They're just not for me. Oh, this is a fun little coloring frame set. So these are all framed and then you can color those in. It does come with markers and then there's a nice little sponge here. So those look like they're dry erase markers maybe? That's pretty cool. So you can color and erase and color again those are for 15 they were 30 so that is 50 percent off it's actually a pretty cool box too i like all the little logos in there it's pretty awesome that's a fun little thing right there and then we've got another little plush character doc ondar cute nice little plush those are from galaxy's edge they're 15 dollars. they were 23 now in terms of other star wars stuff you know we've seen the darth vader costume we've seen the dio remote control we have not seen Luke Skywalker socks. These are Tatooine socks. They fit sizes US 6 to 12, so they would fit my foot. Awesome. They're $5. That's a great deal. And then up here, this is really cool. This is a little uh, crossbody like hip thing. Um, phone holder slash wallet slash passport holder slash all you can do. And I love the logo on this. They made a backpack as well that I was really digging. I regret not buying it. Just a really cool, and I love the lightsaber on this too. Look at that, the detail on this is so cool. It feels really well put together, and they're $25, they were 50. They also have these little kids belts as well. These are $13, and you can see the little, you got your droid R2-D2 on there. We've got Chewbacca, so it's a nice little belt, as you can see. And then they've got a larger belt. I'm not entirely sure what's going on here. It's got a lot of things going on on it. I think that's for kids, yep, youth. Those are $15, they were $40, they're nice little leather belts. So a couple things that are different are this Heli Hansen quarter zip up sweatshirt. It's nice and light. It's going for $35. It was $70. The only problem is they only have smalls and extra larges, which I was bummed about because I would totally buy a medium. I love the color. It's a nice gray. And they also have a blue jacket. I love my Heli Hansen jackets. I own a few of them. They're great for the parks. This is going for $82 and it was $165. That's a really great deal on these jackets. You're not going to find a better deal. And they've got smalls and mediums and extra larges and a couple other different sizes as well. So really great place to grab those. And then they do have some Epcot clothing that we haven't seen or maybe we saw at the last store but we haven't seen at this store. Um, nice t-shirt here with those two buttons on top. Those are $18. This we've got only one of these style shirts. I remember these being from like the one Creations 
opened up. These are $5 now, and they only have the uh, the 2XL. They do have these other style long sleeves, which are pretty cool with the Spaceship Earth logos on there. Those are good for 20. They were 40, so they're half off. Extra large, large, medium, 2X. And then they've got joggers to go with it. Looks like those are Capri style. And those are going for $25. And a tank top going for $17 and they were $35. Now they do have this top and I don't know if this is a jacket or a shirt. It's more of a shirt. It's kind of like light in some spots but then heavy in other spots. It's a really interesting design. It's $40, was $80. So I guess just by touching it, I'm not surprised it ended up here at the warehouse. But it is pretty cool. It's got snaps on it. So that makes me believe it's more of a jacket rather than a shirt. This beautiful snow white jacket as well in there. There's that little apple. It looks more orangish, but it is an apple. I promise you because I'm going to turn it around the few times I actually flip things around here. But there you go. It's got that beautiful snow white logo is the minimalist art. I do really enjoy that. I think it's really well done. I think it's very cool. And these jackets are going for something. Where's the price? I'll have to find it real quick. Sometimes they tuck them away on the inside here. There they are. I found it. They are $60. I don't know what the actual original price is though. They don't have that posted. Oh, excuse me. It's actually a pretty fun shirt with Mickey playing the piano on it. It's a long sleeve polo. My dad used to call these rugby shirts, rugby style shirts. They're going for $25. They were 55. Nothing on the backside, but I do. I think it's a really cool top. Going, they got smalls and larges only. And then they've got this, which is like, it's like a polo style feel to it, but it doesn't have the collar. So it's a long, it's a short sleeve shirt, but it's pretty heavy. And let's see what the price is on this. These are going for $20. They were 37 in the park. Nothing on the backside of those. They have the duck shirt. I love this. Ducktails. Maybe not ducktails. Yeah, ducktails. It's got a bunch of ducks on it. I love it. These are going for $30. They were 60, so that 50% off. They only have them in smalls left though, unfortunately. And then the Halloween shirt, I actually really like this, but if you know me, I wish that it buttoned all the way up. I don't like this style of, oh, this one does button all the way up. Look at that. I didn't realize that. So maybe, uh, well, maybe, no, well, I still don't like the way the collar lays. I wish that button was a little bit higher. It was like more like right there. That would be my, that would be my speed. But yeah, I think it's a really cool shirt. It's only $15, wow. That's an awesome deal, it was 60. Can't get much better than that. Now they do have some 50th stuff, it's starting to trickle in. We're gonna see a lot more of this in the coming months as the 100 collection rolls out. These are down to $25, they were $60 in the parks. They're nice and light. It is a really cool top. I did not want buy, I didn't buy one for myself, it wasn't me. It wasn't for me, like I said, I don't like the way that collar lays, it's not, it's not my, that's not for me. But other than that, really cool shirt, great price. They've got them in extra larges only right now here at the Character Warehouse. Now we did find some new tops in the women's section. Here we've got this awesome, oh my gosh, these are great characters. I know that's Daisy, but who are the other two? I'm gonna need help with that, let me know in the comments. Those are $12.99, that's such a great shirt. So that's the front, that's the back side. So someone's got this spun around. So you can't totally see what's happening. So cool. And then we've got a You Can Fly shirt, this is awesome. Ladies, this is a $13 shirt. And then we've got a Ready to Stand Sick of Swimming a nice little tail down there that's a fun little shirt with featuring just a little bit of aerial so it's very subtle and those are 13 dollars as well as a nice little tank top and down below here not a prize to be won i love that with the lamp on there such a cool shirt these are going for 13 dollars as well so lots of good deals happening and then we've got some stretchy pants some nice shorts here going for 13 dollars with normally 37 Nice little shorts. So large, extra large, and th 3X it looks like. And there's a Tinkerbell top here as well. They got those in extra small and in medium, which is interesting. And they are $13. Couple other shirts here. We got a Doctor Strange top for $13. So the, the general theme here is most shirts are $13, $14, $15, which is great to see. And like I said, if you wanna see a really comprehensive look at the remainder of the clothing, go ahead and watch that video. We posted about a week ago. Um, I'll include a link in the description for you all as well. Here's the Main Street Electrical Parade. I love that, how that pops off. That's a nice little font there. So that shirt is nice and stretchy. It's like a, it's like an athletic style shirt. Let's see if we can grab a price on one of these. 
Looks like all the tags have been ripped off. These are going for $15. Does look like there's a few new pieces of kids clothing. We're gonna check that out really quick. We've got this shirt right here. That's from that Star Wars collection. Those are $13. They've got those in extra small all the way up to extra large. They got this Tiana top, which is really cute. It looks like it's two different pieces. Oh, it's a skirt. So it comes with the top and the skirt. Nice two pieces going for $20. And down below, let's see what we've got here. We've got a few different pieces, another more, more Tiana stuff, because there's lots of Tiana being featured at the parks. Obviously with the Tiana's Bayou Adventure coming, $15 for those. But really what we wanted to see is this beautiful dress from the Christmas collection. These were like a hundred, or no, they're $60, $70. And they're down to $25 here at the Character Warehouse. That's an amazing deal. It's a beautiful dress. They've got a beautiful little headband that goes with it. These are going for $8. They were $20. And then they have a jacket up here that goes with it as well. These are going for $30 and they were $60. You can see nice, beautiful detail in that. So really cool to see that. And then they've got these frozen jackets. These are full of detail on the inside and on the outside. So you can see there, it's not reversible. So though, just keep that in mind. Those are $20, they were $50 at the park. Now down below, we've got some more frozen dresses. These are two different pieces. Looks like that one's kind of falling apart or falling off the hanger, I should say. It's $20, was 40. And then another style dress here. This features Stitch from that Stitch collection this last summer. It was very cool to see. Those are going for 15. And here we have a beautiful mini mouse hooded sweatshirt. It's so soft on the inside nice bejeweled on the um, pocket with a unicorn and I feel like there's something on the back there is let's check that out really quick and look at that on the back side we've got mini all those jewels on there so cool and those were 45 they are going for 25 so it's good to see there's a lot looks like a little bit more variety in the kids clothing now than there has been in the last few times we've been here. Cause I know the last time we did a video, it was like all the same stuff from the last few months, but good to see a new variety show up. Some different Jack Skellington shirts. Very cool to see all that going for $13. Really great deals. We've got an awesome, this looks like an America Chavez. So that's from the Multiverse of Madness, Doctor Strange movie for kids. Those are $25. So I remember seeing this jacket for adults and there's the backside of it, very cool. Excited to see her character develop in the MCU. It's gonna be fun. They've introduced a lot of characters. Ooh, check this out. This is super fuzzy. This is a Frozen style. It's got a cape on it, but Miss Edna Mode would say no capes. Now, good thing it is Velcro, so you can remove the cape if you don't want the cape on there. They are $20, they were $47. They're so soft. In the boys section, unfortunately, we're not seeing any real differences. Will trade brother for candy. I think that shirt's hilarious. It's $13. The wild shirt from Big Thunder is $11. The star power shirt. We've got some Slotha baby. These are some PJ sets. These are from Miss Marvel. They're going for $15. Um, but really, we're seeing a lot of the same stuff. Haven't seen a whole lot of new things show up here. Um, we've got this awesome shirt. I love the design of this. I really did. I keep saying it. I will say it until it's gone. $15 for that. There's those Marvel Spirit jerseys again. Got a Hawkeye shirt, an Avenger shirt. That one's really cool. I do like that for kids. I'd like that as an adult shirt too. Don't see a price on that one. Looks like the tags have been ripped off, unfortunately. They're probably in the $11 to $12 range, so pretty good deal. And then there's the Marvel Christmas shirts. Those were $20. Looks like no one's tagged those yet. So I'm unsure of what those are. Oh, here's one. Nope, maybe $12, maybe $13. We'll see another sloth baby. This is a hooded, like military jacket style. So it's nice and thick. And they were 45, but once again, they don't have the price on them. The discount, oh, there we go, $25. And then an awesome Avengers V-neck shirt. Those I feel like are more girl cut. Those are $13. This is probably one of the better deals. This is the 50th anniversary shimmer headbands. Only going for $4. They were $35. That's one heck of a deal. They should buy those here at the Character Warehouse. And the $15 earbands here, once again, I love this look. I love this style. They don't have the spirit. 
I don't know if they have the spirit jersey here for these anymore. They are at the other character warehouse. They do have the adjustable headband. Those are $6. And the Mighty Thor headband going for $15. And these floral headbands, which are also $15. One of the best deals, gotta be the 2022 headbands. And you know what, everybody? My battery is about to die. I hope you enjoyed this video. Definitely subscribe if you enjoyed. Give us a like, leave a comment down below, and we will see you next time we tour the Disney Character Warehouse.